All right, hey guys. Um, I'm gonna show you how to uh, install Pinnacle Game Profiler and get it running, and show you a little bit of a game in five easy steps. All right, so first step is you're gonna need to download now this big orange button. Click that, and you go through steps downloading it. I'm not gonna do that because I already have it downloaded. So second step is to uh, click on this P icon right here. Wait for it to load. Doesn't take too long. Now, real quick, um, it automatically detects your controller. So it depends on whatever controller you have. I use the Afterglow controller because it's the easiest one. Um, but you can plug in like a PS3 controller or whatever. They all work the same. Um, now, what you're going to want to do is, for step three, is go to this link right here. Click to download profiles instantly and start playing right away. And let that load. Now, one real quick thing is, um, say you completely don't know the name of the game. You just know, like, the beginning of it, like, just world. Oh, world. Um, you get all these games come up with worlds. See, World Tour, World. Right now, I'm looking for World of Warcraft. Um, don't, oh, see, there it is on third page, World of Warcraft. But that was a little quick tidbit. But the game I'm going to be doing is Minecraft. And now, what you're going to want to do is just click download. And this is step three just to let you guys know. Um, now, it does say I have a PS3 controller. They all work the same. I'm using my Afterglow controller. So, now all you gotta do is click Install Profile. Installing now. And see, so you'll say up here in the top, New Profile Created Minecraft. Click on that. And I already had it downloaded, but I just re-downloaded it to show you guys. Doesn't matter. Um, fourth step is to click on that. It'll bring this up, and now it'll show you a configuration of the controllers of what the game will play, like how to run and jump and mine and everything else like that. Um, it'll auto-close, or you can just close. Alright, real quick before we get started, um, I just want to show you, if you guys don't like the controls the way they're set up, you want your own controls, go to Game Profiles, go to uh, Edit Configurations, and from here you can just do anything you want. You can just make inventory, the chat con command, or anything you want, and make it as enjoyable as you want to play it. But um, that's just real quick, and now we can get started on playing yourself. And as you can see, it says playing Minecraft. Now I'll show you a little bit of uh, the gameplay. Okay. See, as you can tell though, you can already tell you're gonna you're using the controller just because of the way I'm moving the mouse up and down. Um now to uh, select things use the right trigger. Let's just load real quick. Oh god. Okay. Now it's just just like no um normal. Use the joysticks to move around. Uh one thing I do want to point out though is if you do press start and you go into options um, I boosted up my sensitivity to 130 percent because I feel like um, it feels more natural so but um, let's see left triggers to uh, open up doors and place blocks right triggers to pick up or attack why is to use your menu Let's make a uh, let's make a crafting table real quick here. Uh, right triggers to pick up, left triggers to place. Right triggers to get it. Oh, I already have three of them. Press Y again. Use the D-pads to go back and forth. And we'll just place this down right here. 
And also, um, the right bumper is to jump like a maniac. Left bumper is to sneak. A is to jump also. And then another cool thing I like, obviously, see, I'm trying to type with my controller, which isn't going to work. Um, if you just press B on the controller, you'll be able to just bring up the screen menu real quick and just be like, type real quick. And then, um, another real quick thing I want to show you guys is if you press Y, and if you guys don't like how the controller or the mouse is moving so quickly and you're trying to like get things to the slow down a little bit, if you toggle the right stick, your mouse will slow down, kind of act like a D-pad, and you can place things real smooth. And it's not that hard. But, just to speed this up a little bit. Okay. Now, let's make something, because I feel like making something. Give you guys more of a gameplay. Um, I don't know what I want to make. Make some stick stuff. Or maybe a. Yeah, that'll probably work. You need to make an axe and probably run a mow on them. Oh, look at that. Tells you how long I've been playing this one. No, I'm just kidding. Alright. But yeah, that's um pretty much it. If you guys have any questions or comments, um, just like and subscribe to this video, and if you got any problems, uh, just let me know in the comments below.